Mike Walters is the CPO at Form3, a company that provides cloud native, a payment technology for other companies. Today, he talks to us about what makes cloud native so important in today's fintech world, Form3's recent collaborations, as well as his hopes for the future of Form3. My name is Aya Karleva, and we are excited to have you on this interview for Financial IT. Hi, uh, delighted to be here as well. Uh, my name is Mike Walters. I'm the CPO at Form3, uh, so responsible for the product organization um, across, uh, across our business. Form3 is a, a cloud-native uh, managed service provider for payments, and that means that we deliver technology to regulated businesses um, to help them to process and deliver payments to other banks, but also uh, to central infrastructures um, around the world. The cloud native thrives in the COVID-19 era. And how is the pandemic turning financial institutions to cloud native systems? And what's the role of Form 3 in keeping the sector lean and agile? Yes, yeah, so, so cloud native, um, we, we are um, by, by design and by birth. We uh, design the platform, the operating model, um, you know, the fact that our whole organization is, is remote. Um, you know, those have all been designed around uh, leveraging the cloud. So not just the services we give to our customers, but actually the way we run the business um, and the tooling that we use to do that. Uh, the infrastructure of the business has really not been hit by the last six months. What we observe across our clients, we only service um, regulated financial institutions, um, but they range in size quite dramatically from small payment service providers and the money license holding businesses um, all the way through to enterprise customers. So tier one banks, the last six months have really reinforced some of the clear advantages of that. Um, and those are being embraced by the larger organizations that we work with. So, you know, we spend a lot of time with our enterprise customers, um, not just on functionality and build, but actually on ways of working. So, you know, how is it, how is it and how should we put teams uh, to, to deliver for them? Uh, how should they actually use the service? How do, they, how do they embed that? What types of technology and tool chains do they use? What the pandemic has, has kind of accelerated is a need for organizations to really look at the types of infrastructure they run. Tier one global financial institutions who recognize the power of being in a cloud native environment. Um, and so our job is to is to help them not only with ways of working, but also make sure we stay on the very front end of this, um, making sure we remain a, a product centric organization. So we build things that customers use. That's much more resilient to these types of shocks. So customers can choose how they use them, use our products and services. And that by definition makes them, uh, makes makes the whole the whole system more resilient. It's, it's a very um, sort of clean, um, sort of product centric view of, of how our customers interact with us. Farm3 has recently formed a collaboration uh, with Counting Up and PPS to transform the UK SME banking with the next generation cloud based technology. Uh, could you please tell us more about these collaborations? We collaborate a lot with organizations um, where we have strengths that complement theirs um, and, and, and vice versa. So Working with uh, Counting Up and, and a really long-standing customer of ours, PPS, is is great because each three of the organisations, you know, genuinely excel at um, at different parts of what you really need to to help UK SMEs to to to, to flourish in some quite challenging times. So, you know, Counting Up, um, you know, clearly making significant waves and progress in helping SMEs to just be more efficient, to take the headache out of the the way that. Uh, accounting and reconciliation works and insights into businesses that help them work uh, more efficiently. PPS as a regulated financial institution being able to help with licenses and the holding of funds and the, the, the movement of those. And then both of those organisations being able to leverage our cloud native payment technology to actually achieve some of those outcomes. Um, it's just a really good fit between three organisations that have um, you know, different different levels of expertise, but where you need all of that in order to uh, to make a to make a real change. What is next for Form Three, and what excites you the most about the future of Form Three? A lot is next uh, for us. So um, we're continuing to grow super fast, maintaining the culture, maintaining the things that have made us successful so far. Continuing to invest and focus on the technology um, is really really important. Um, and doing that in a sustainable way is really important for us. It's about expanding the numbers of products and services we deliver to customers. Um, it's about looking at the markets that we do that in. 
Um, we're currently in the UK and Europe, but clearly as a, as a technology provider, you know, the world has similar challenges uh, in pretty much every market where banks and financial services operate. The other area of growth that's exciting for us is the coming on stream of really, really large tier one um, relationships and uh, volumes. Um, and so what that is really doing is demonstrating to the market the readiness of cloud native technology for significant uh, volume and services um, to, to these players. So that's hugely exciting for us because when you build a platform, knowing that's what you're shooting for, you still have to win those businesses, win those deals and, um, and, and have partners that, uh, that are like-minded in what you're trying to achieve. We still have a long way to go uh, and, and a huge opportunity to do that across uh, other customers in the UK, Europe and, and around the world. Thank you for talking to us about Form 3 and the details of the company and you know the big moves during the pandemic um, and the future. So thank you. Uh, you're most welcome. Lovely to meet you. Thank you very much.